If you are watching closely, as is everyone else, to see what happens with this submersible now at the bottom of the ocean. Apparently, it was produced by some dude with basically like a hot water heater and some hoses, and then he was charging people $250,000 to go down and view the Titanic. Well, the air is running out. It's a really horrifying and tragic situation. All I would ask is that the sort of resources that we are currently expending on helping the people at the bottom of the ocean, we should expend like a fraction of those resources on, say, people trying to escape the communist hellhole of Cuba by floating out into the middle of the shark-infested waters on, like, an old Chevy. And meanwhile, Hunter Biden has now been let off the hook, and it is unclear whether all other investigations, criminal investigations into him have been shut down. His own lawyer is now saying that he expects there will be no further criminal investigations into Hunter Biden, but the district attorney in his case is saying the opposite. He's saying the U.S. attorney is saying, well, there might be further investigations. We'll have to see what emerges. If this was just a way to paper over Hunter's other legal problems, man, is that a cover up.